guys welcome back to another video on the Emplesim Hobbies channel so today we are going to look at the matchbox moving part working parts e1 mobile command and all the different styles paint jobs they did and we're gonna race some of them down the track and see which one is the fastest um so yeah uh leave a like if you're excited don't forget to hit that subscribe button and uh let's get started so i will save the best for last um so the first one we will do is this uh, State Police Tactical Operations Center. Uh, this is um, probably the third or fourth one we got. It's pretty cool. So all the E1s, they have this little antenna radio telescope thing that folds up, spins around. Little antenna that comes up. And then of course the slide outs come out as well. And as you can see on the other side, this is one of my favorite matchbox working rigs, working parts, vehicles, and I really hope they re-release re one in the upcoming future. And, um, this isn't my favorite, but, um, it's a really cool one. I really like the blue, and here's the front, it says police, Taps Cooperation Center. I really like the slide outs and stuff, and well, they, uh, released this one twice, and, uh, here's a unopened version. And, um, so yeah, that one's the State Police, uh, E1, and, uh, now we'll move on to the Sheriff E1, which is pretty cool. It's got gold and black right here, number 76, unit 76, and the kind of folds up, slide outs come out, right, like that, as you can see, and it's got, it's pretty detailed as well, it's got all the little compartments and air conditioning vents up there and you know it's pretty neat and then next we have our mbx mission force crime crew police operation center there's a lot of police ones as you can see and um this one is one of my least favorites but it's still pretty cool you can't really go wrong with these Matchbox E1s. As you can see, one of the reasons I like I like this front end because it has that little these little stripes on the fender, the, the bumper and right there, and that's pretty cool. So this is the the set that, that came in. It doesn't just come in a in a single package like this one. It has you have to buy it in a set, or you can find an eBay listing somewhere that has sells this individually, but this is the Mission Force set that it comes in. As you can see, there it is right there. It has the helicopters, and then the Ford Police K-9 unit interceptor, which is pretty cool. These are one of the older Mission Force Prime Crew ones. They also have like a fire rescue one, a ton of other cool ones, a ton of other cool ones. And then they released some of them. They have a jungle one, a police one, a construction one, and one other. But, um, I'm pretty sure it might be a fire one. Uh, yeah, it's pretty cool. Um, this next one, it really isn't an actual uh, matchbox like E1 command center. It is the uh, the Scania Scania tactical command center. It isn't it isn't the E1. Uh, this was released a couple couple years ago, back in like 2019, and they did another version of it, but where it was a mobile hospital, and basically it came in a the Thank You Hero set from Matchbox. As you can see, it's Scania, and then a cool feature about this is it has one big slide out, stairs come out, as you can see, that's pretty cool. So yeah, now one of my second favorite E1, the first one I got, is the Hillsborough County Fire Rescue. I love the color on this one. And again, I love the stripes on the fender, the bumper here. That is awesome. And then we have the slide outs here. I just, I really like this vehicle. And, uh, turn it folds up. This comes up. It's pretty cool. So yeah, now we, we will move on to my favorite E1. I don't, I sadly don't have one to open, but my favorite one is the Special Edition Heroic Rescue Human Mobile Command Center. This is the Matchbox 
fire department version, and this was the last one released. And it came in a set of the special edition heroic rescues, the Be a Hero ones, and uh, they basically they come in a set of four or five. There was a there was the E one, which is the most wanted one, and then there was the Fire Stalker, the special edition Fire Stalker, the special edition Pierce Quantum, special edition Pierce Velocity, and there might have been one other, but I'm pretty sure that's it. But um, they're really cool vehicles. And if I get up my hands on a third one, then I will definitely open it. But I have two of them here, as you can see. They're really cool vehicles. I love the paint job on them. So yeah, they're pretty neat. Here's the background of it. And so yeah, these are the other vehicles. The Fire Stalker, E1 Mobile Command Center, Pierce Quanta, and Pierce Velocity. Both of which are fire trucks, and this one's like a big monster fire truck, the fire stalker. And E1 is my favorite. So yeah, now let's take the opened E1s out on the track and uh, see which one's the fastest. Now, I probably shouldn't be doing this, but like, that's okay, who cares? It might damage the E1s, but whatever. Uh, they fit on the track, they're, they're just fine. So let's put them on. We have the Police Tactical Operations Center. We have the Hillsborough County Command Center. We have the Matchbox Police one on the uh, Mission Force kit. And then we have the Sheriff one in lane number four. And as you can see, we're in that. Straighten them out a little bit. Okay. And the finish line is ready and waiting. So, uh, Take your best now. Three, two, one. And it looks like the Sheriff E1 won that race. I guess that's the fastest one. Somehow all four gates were out, but it doesn't look like the TOC police one didn't made, made it through the first one. I really don't know how that happened, but um, cool. Second place went to the this one right here. Third place went to, I think, just like bounced off and triggered it. And then I guess this is my slowest C1, but that's okay. So here we have our fastest C1, and it kind of deserves that title. Um, it's pretty cool. So yeah, I'd like to thank you guys for watching my videos. This is such a fun. It's such fun to make videos for you guys, but if you want us to keep it up, be sure to hit the subscribe button and uh, hit the notifications bell so you don't miss another video. And um, yeah, peace.